With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The question is evaluate the integration of 2x minus 5 into under root of 2 plus 3x minus x square dx. So here, let us assume that our i is equal to integration of 2x minus 5 into under root of 2 plus 3x minus x square dx. Now, let us assume that our 2x minus 5 is equal to lambda into d by dx of 2x, sorry, 2 plus 3x minus x square plus of mu here. Now, finally, here we have 2x minus 5 is equal to lambda into d by dx of 2 plus d by dx of 3x minus d by dx of x square plus of mu. Now, here we know that, now we know that that d by dx of x raised to power n is equal to n into x raised to power minus 1, x raised to power n minus 1 and the derivative of any constant, any here we have d by dx of any constant is equal to 0. So, from here we have 2x minus 5 is equal to lambda, here we have 0 plus 3 minus of 2x here plus of mu. Now finally, after solving it further, here we have 2x minus 5 is equal to lambda into 3 minus 2x plus of mu. So from here we have 2x minus 5 is equal to 3 lambda minus 2 lambda x plus of mu. Now by comparing the coefficients of x on both sides, so here we have minus 2 lambda is equal to 2. So, from here we have lambda is equal to minus of 1. Now, comparing the constants on, on the both sides, so here we have 3 lambda plus of mu is equal to minus of 5 and lambda is our minus 1. So, here we have minus 3 plus mu is equal to minus 5. So, from here the value of mu is minus of 2. Now, next, hence we have as we know that we have 2x minus 5 is equal to minus of 3 minus 2x minus 2. Hence, we have this. Now, on substituting the value of i, we can write the integral as our i is equal to in integration of, here we have minus of 3 minus 2x minus of 2 into the in the under root of 2 plus 3x minus x square minus x square into dx. Now here we have i is equal to the integration of here we have minus 3 minus 2x minus minus of 3 minus 2x into under root of 2 plus 3x minus x square minus 2 into under root of 2 plus 3x minus x square into dx. Now, after solving it further, here we have i is equal to, here we will take negative of common, so here we have negative of integration of 3 minus 2x, 3 minus 2x into under root of 2 plus 3x minus x square dx minus of the integration of 2 into under root of 2 plus 3x minus x square dx. So here finally i is equal to minus of integration of 3 minus 2x into under root of 2 plus 3x minus x square into dx minus of 2 into integration of under root of 2 plus 3x minus x square dx now here let our i1 now let our i1 and that is equal to minus of integration of 3 minus 
टू एक्स इन टू अंडर रूट ऑफ टू प्लस थ्री एक्स माइनस एक्स स्क्वेयर इन टू डी एक्स सो फ्रॉम हेयर लेट्स पुट लेट्स पुट टू प्लस थ्री एक्स माइनस एक्स स्क्वेयर एज इक्वल टू टी सो हेयर ऑन डिफ्रेंशिएशिंग ऑन डिफ्रेंशिएशन बोथ ऑफ साइड विद रिस्पेक्ट ऑफ एक्स सो हेयर वी हैव थ्री माइनस टू एक्स डी एक्स एंड दैट इज इक्वल टू डी टी नाउ ऑन सब्सिट्यूटिंग दिस वैल्यू इन आवर आई वन इन आवर गी वन आई वन सो हेयर वी हैव आई वन इज इक्वल टू माइनस ऑफ इंटीग्रेशन ऑफ अंडर रूट टी डी टी नाउ हेयर we can write this as i1 as minus of integration of t let me correct it here t of t raised to power of 1 by 2 dt now as we know that the integration of x raised to power n dx x raised to power n dx is equal to x raised to power n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 plus of c now using this formula so here we have i1 is equal to minus of here we have t raised to power 1 by 2 plus of 1 divided by 1 by 2 plus of 1 plus c so from here it is equal to minus 1 minus of t raised to power 3 by 2 divided by 3 by 2 plus of c now here our i1 is equal to minus of 2 by 3 into t raised to power 3 by 2 plus of c Now substitute the value of t here. So here we have i one is equal to minus of two by three into two plus three x minus x square divided raised to power three by two plus of c. Now here let's say that our i two. Now let's say that our i two and that is equal to minus of two into the integration of under root of two plus three x minus x square. This is our three x minus x square. dx so now we can write this as our 2 plus 3x minus x square is equal to minus taking minus common so here we have minus of x square minus 3x minus 2 so now here we have 2 plus 3x minus x square and it is equal to here let me correct it here here it is equal to minus of x square minus 2x into 3 by 2, 2 into x into 3 by 2 plus of 3 by 2 whole square minus of 3 by 2 whole square minus of 2. So this step written by using our completing the square method. Completing the square method. Now after solving it further, here we have 2 plus 3x minus of x square, and that is equal to minus of Here we have x minus c. Here we can write this, write this as x minus three by two whole square minus of nine by four minus two. Now here we have after solving it further, here we have two plus three x minus x square, and that is equal to minus of x minus three by two whole square. Here we have whole square minus of Seventeen by four. So now, after solving it further, here we have two plus three x minus x square, and that will be equal to seventeen by four minus of x minus three by two whole square. Now, next here we have two plus three x minus x square, and that will be equal to under root of seven by two. Whole square. This is by two whole square minus of x minus three by two whole square. Now here we have as we know that i two was equal to minus two into here we have under root of under root seven by two whole square minus of x minus three by two whole square dx. So now, as we know that there is an identity that integration of under root of a square minus x square into dx, and this is equal to x by two into under root of a square minus x square plus of a square by two sine inverse of x by a plus of c. So using this identity here, 
the value here of i2 is equal to minus of 2 here we have minus of 2 into x minus 3 by 2 divided by here 2 into the under root of 17 under root of under root 17 by 2 whole square minus of x minus 3 by 2 whole square here we have plus of under root of 17 by 2 whole square divided by 2 into sin inverse of here this was in continuity of this so here we have sin inverse of x minus 2 here we have x minus 3 by 2 divided by under root of 17 by 2 17 by 2 plus of c so here after solving it further here we have i2 is equal to minus of 2 into 2x minus 3 by 4 into under root of 2 plus 3x let me correct it here here we have 2 plus 3x minus of x square plus of 17 by 8 sine inverse of 2x 2x minus of 3 divided by under root of 17 plus of c and here next we have i2 and that will be equal to minus 1 by 2 minus 1 by 2 into 2x minus of 3 into under root of 2 plus 3x minus x square minus 17 by 8 here we have minus 17 by 8 let me correct it here here will be minus 17 by 4 here will be minus 17 by 4 sine inverse of 2x minus 3 divided by under root of 17 plus c so now on substituting the value of i1 and i2 in our given i so here we have i is equal to minus 2 by 3 here we have minus 2 by 3 into 2 plus 3x plus x square it was negative of x square so here we have negative of x square whole raised to power 3 by 2 minus of 1 by 2 into 2x minus 3 into under root of 2 plus 3x minus x square minus 17 by 4 sine inverse of 2x minus 3 by 4 let me correct it here here it is 2x minus 3 divided by under root of 17 plus of c so from here we can say that this is our final answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today